Oh, wide open all day. Run him over. There's a lot of pressure on my shoulders right now. I've been carrying the Bears franchise. I talked a lot of trash last time, which got me in a little trouble. But I've been carrying this team so far week after week. And right now, we are moving ourselves into the playoffs against the LA Rams. So, got an opportunity here. We're going to upgrade receiving back, uh, which now puts it at an 85 overall, which should unlock some ability slots. So, we get plus one to awareness, catching traffic, catching a short route. Again, in an ability slot. And we're also going to go to a loose back here because... You know, I kind of I juke about the speed of a turtle right now. We want to improve that. So plus one to agility, carrying and juke move, plus two to break tackle. That's all good news for me. So here is the new ability slot that we have, which has a whole bunch of new stuff for us. So energizer, uh, you'll replenish a portion of their stamina upon successfully performing any skill move. Interesting. Arm bar, you guys know what that is. It's from last year. It's all about stiff arms. Grab and go. We've seen without elite. We sort of sort of talk about backfield mismatches. Also from last year, I believe. Human joystick is really what I want right here. I really want to get that one. So that's all about quickly shifting your momentum, change direction, and turning the corner without sacrificing speed. Jukebox would be fantastic. That's not unlocked yet either. We can't really select it. And then evasive, uh, this ability that's steerable juke and spin animations. 100% here for that too. Really all we have is energizer to really add. So we'll grab that for right now. We gotta keep on leapfrog, because again, we have the same two abilities from before, haven't unlocked the other ones. And we're gonna keep our guy with first one free. I want some more abilities. I don't know how to unlock them. But we'll figure that out. Press Making it to the conference playoffs is time. Fun, but that's when the pressure really sets in. Because for okay. us and our fans, there's only one acceptable outcome. Yup. A win on Super Bowl Sunday. You already know. Bear down. Is that what y'all say? Tough break. Allen Robinson the second wasn't cleared for contact and is out for the playoff game. Huh? Okay, okay, so we go, we're underdogs, which includes, or sort of boosts up our entertainer spot, or we can go great teams persevere, which increases our leadership spot. I'm, hey, look, we're underdogs, baby. You already know. Teams have shocked the world before. Remember the 2007 Giants, the 2017 Eagles? We're underdogs, just like they were. Let's embrace it. Um, charismatic, I just. Losing him was a major blow to you know? our playbook, but we wouldn't find out just how much of an advantage it was to our opponents until we were actually facing him. Okay, that's not good news. Not good news at all. So Alan Graham injured for two games. Is it Alan Robinson? Who's Alan Graham? Is it Alan Robinson or Jimmy Graham? Or have they fused to be one superhuman? Find out in the next episode of Dragon Ball Z. Whoa, strong start. Your X Factors on a game start. I can carry the team. I have an X Factor. What is it? Challenge accepted. Plus ten man covers all Ram CBs for game one. Oh, this is going to be different, huh? So go big in the playoffs game. They go win the game. Easier said than done, but I'm going to try. All right, Bears fans. All seven of you. Are you ready? We're going to face the ice cream uniform team, the LA Rams. Why is Nagy already throwing his clipboard? No. Still got Mitchell Trubisky. Why couldn't you have told me, hey, man, Trubisky's injured. Your chances of winning just went up tenfold. You know? But you didn't. Now I got to carry the team even more. I hate it. I know the face of the franchise has gotten sort of a mixed opinion from a lot of you guys, but you got to admit, these little things they're doing to spice up the playoffs and big moments of the season are fantastic. Your boys out here with a solid carry. I'm going to take that four yard gain. So if you look at our receiving core, we got Wims, Miller, Graham, and Patterson. So apparently Jimmy Graham and Allen Robinson didn't fuse to become one superhuman for the playoffs. They both, or excuse me, Allen Robinson is the guy that's injured. Oh, where the blitz is coming from. Let's go. Big catch whims. All right. We got a little first down and 10. Life's looking good right now. Trubisky out here completed a pass. First time in his life. He's going to complete a second one. Trubisky's on fire. Just kidding. That's what normal quarterbacks do. Right away. Right. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. The Rams are a really tough team just to run against because they've got that man right there. Aaron Donald. He's incredible. If you expected me to talk a little bit of trash about Aaron Donald, I don't want to lose my life. That man would punch a hole through my chest. Wouldn't be pretty. Oh, Jalen Ramsey cannot stop Anthony Miller. Okay. All right. Now the Rams know we can actually pass the football. It's surprising. No one really thought we could do that because we got Trubisky as our quarterback. But hey, it is what it is. Oh, look at this solid run. Look at that solid. I ran him over. I'm strong. 
we want to obviously like not run it up the middle non-stop we would like to run it on the outside but it all depends on how our guys block because i want to run away from aaron donald as much as possible look at this blocking though oh my god our goal today we've been challenged to get three rushing touchdowns that's one more to come also two things one i forgot to turn off full team control i'm gonna do it after this game are you sure about that second the rams threw a pick i wasn't paying attention sim to play and i scored a five yard rushing touchdown so i got two on the day we're in the first quarter imagine that life is good if you're a good game brother oh that man hit me hard first quarter's winding down it's looking good i literally just need one more rushing touchdown if i don't get that today i'm fighting everyone jimmy graham okay i wonder when trubisky like throws passes like that if he's like oh that's good i feel good about that or if he's just like why does my arm suck you know, I'm, I'm always curious about that. That man just fell down to the field. Whoop. Okay. First quarter's done. We got a nice little lead of 14 to 3. I like that a lot. See if we can extend that, though. Give her solid runs here. Okay, get out of here. I'm breaking tackles today. Here we go. Trubisky trying to calm the stadium down. No one's listening to him, though. Imagine. Keep it running. Really is going to make a good little grab. Get us down to the 40. Second and short again. 11 point lead's looking pretty good. Five minutes left here in the first half. Give her some blocking. Whoop! Hold on. You can't stop. I won't stop. I'm the greatest running back that you've ever seen. In the entire NFL, I got some dreams to dominate one touchdown at a time. No one can compete. I'm surprised this rhymes. That's just Spotify top 10. And I'm not in 10 through 2. Do the math. This is the most success the Bears have had in a long time, you know? Not surprised. I'm here. Look at what's happening. The Rams did get a field goal, though. So they're not, like, super far behind. They're just trying their best, but it's not good enough. Things are good, though. Second and inches now under three minutes. We got a chance to drive, put more points on the board. You know I'm here for that. Aaron Donald, get away from me. The juke moves are starting to pull together, baby. I like it. I like it a lot. I think having that energizer ability, though, is actually kind of nice because I can see myself pulling off multiple moves and my stamina is still being good after I go nope. through them. That felt like a face mask. Help me out, ref. A little second down and eight. Two minutes left here in the first quarter, or first half. Trubisky out here. I'm blaming Trubisky. Third down and eight. Here I am with my X Factor. Coach won't give me the football. I'm a little salty. Yay! Well, make me do it again. Trubisky's out here sabotaging us, and the Rams have struck back. They have an eight-point deficit right now. Give it to the greatest player ever touch a football. Okay, okay, that's a solid carry. I'll take it. Under a minute left, got three timeouts. Can't take them into the next half, so I don't know why we haven't used them, but you know what? Let's not talk about it. That is a grown man catch. Absolutely. The okay, game, bro, obviously, is a grown man. He's playing in the NFL. If you don't understand what I'm saying, I hate you. First and 10 again. Wow. Oh! Huh? Aaron Donald's a superhuman. Michael Brockers has incredible cat like quickness. Surprise, Trubisky made the tackle. We're picking up here in the second half after that just debacle of a drive that we had. It was not great. Would not call that one of my favorite drives of all time, but new drive, new half, new us. All right, we had a false start penalty. You hate to see it. Here we are, second and eight, I believe. Nice break, good throw. No hands. I mean, I'm literally out here trying to give Trubisky some sort of like compliment, you know? Help me. He's my quarterback, he's all I got. There's a penalty. This could possibly go for a lot of yards. Down to the 29, potentially. Who's it on? I'm fighting him. James Daniels, that's a big man. Never mind. If this was like a face of the franchise when I was the left tackle, I'd fight everybody. Unfortunately, it's not, and I'm not fighting anyone. So, if you want fights, go watch my UFC 4 career. Oh! Not a great pass, but a great catch. Bears fans, tell me who Ridley is in the comments right now. 
He's a great player. He's helped out Trubisky a ton today. Not as much as I've helped out Trubisky. Obviously, I taught him how to pass. But he's done a good job. Yeah, I kind of like this Ridley guy a lot. Second and inches now. Little play action. Slipped it in there. Almost was a pick. Okay. Third and inches. We can get this, okay? Just quadruple team Aaron Donald. I don't care about anyone else. I said quadruple team him. Here we go. First and ten again. Quick pass. I'm sorry you have a concussion now. We're taking a lot of time off the clock, which is kind of great. It's considered we're trying to put some more points on the board and extend our lead. I don't want them to have a whole lot of time. I would like them to sort of, you know, scramble a little bit. All right, they're taking me out. We got Jimmy Graham in that slot. Kind of looks nice. We're going to put Miller out here on a streak route. Patterson on a nice little sit down route that gets us about eight or nine yards. Single high safety right now. No press coverage, so we're going to chill. It'd be a run if we can get a block on Donald. Who is this on? How do we hold on the penalty? I mean, I can't use words I'm mad. How do we do that poorly, you know? Don't get the penalty. How? There we go. Down to the 16. Look, I'm not trying to like jinx anything, but I feel like another touchdown is on the horizon. You know, I feel like it is. Okay, okay, keep it moving. Keep your legs moving. Risky's out here. We got Graham on his streak route. Historically, that hasn't worked out. Jimmy Graham. He's back. I know it's been a rough road for him, but Jimmy Graham's back. Okay, Rams aren't playing around. They just got a quick touchdown. A lot of time left in this game. They're only down eight points. I need you offensive line to block. I'll do the rest. Second and four. If I can get to the outside of that, if Jimmy Graham can steal that block, this might be good. Okay, he did not. I got slammed to the ground like a child. Okay, third and two. Trubisky, do what you do best. Throw a short yardage completion. We don't care about anything else. Run it. Okay, the Rams actually struggled a little bit on offense. A minute and a half or so went off the clock. So here we are, 330. Still got a lead. Woo, you see that one cut to get no yards? I really thought coming out here in that first half, that three touchdown performance, I was going to come out here in the second half and just, you know, add another one or two. I was incorrect. That being said, I'm not giving up. Well, I know things are a little bit more tough than I anticipated initially. Oh, wide open all day. Run him over. I think I just saw my dead body. Help that man. Rams are struggling a little bit. Two minute warnings coming up after this play. I'm feeling golden. Block for me. Look, one yard gains. No one cares about those, you know? What if I bounce out to the right? Is that a dumb move? Bruh. Never doing that again. Third and 11. Messed up a little bit too much here. Got to do what works best for us. A screen. Let's go. Great play. Great play. It's my third grab today for 44 yards. I think altogether, I probably have close to 200 yards all purpose offense between returns and everything else we've been doing. All these rushing yards we've been having. Not a bad debut in the playoffs. And also, we still haven't heard back if I got rookie of the year or not. I assume they're deciding that like real life before the Super Bowl. So. No, we got to make sure we lock up some good performances here. I know it's mostly going to be regular season, but I got to show them I'm the real deal. Also, Chicago Bears fans, do you guys cry every night after watching my videos? Realize you'll never have a running back as great as me. It's curious. Yo, Jalen Ramsey just shredded our wide receiver on that play. Three man front with outside linebackers ready to go. Okay, you know what? First tackle was broken. After that, it went bad. They have literally no timeouts left. We're in a good spot. Third and seven. All we got to do is just run one final play. And we should be good to go. I will take that Rams. Bye bye now. Honestly, I feel bad for our kicker. We're going to try to get the kickoff for him. Just because, you know, early in the season, confidence wasn't there. I need his confidence back. You know, kickers are people too. John McVay. Get out of here. You got the W. You already knew that though. Oh, look at the Bears fans. They're hype. Why are y'all? Trubisky, they're not cheering for you. They're cheering. I'm standing behind you. They're cheering for me, not you. After the game, you can see Jared Goff had a pretty good game. Had one turnover, two touchdowns, and 260 yards. Trubisky, you already know the deal. We don't got to look at him. You're watching this part of the video for me. 
27 attempts, 170 yards, three touchdowns. Devonta Freeman, who I didn't know played for the Rams actually now, 10 for 31, golf at two for five, but your boy, it's a heck of a debut. In the air, Cooper Cup literally had an incredible game. Nine grabs, 165 yards, and a touchdown, not a single drop. Riley Ridley, whose name we now know, I should have known that, 454, no touchdowns. Robert Woods had a couple of grabs. Your boy at three for 44. And then Jimmy Graham again, back in the end zone. That's good to see. Our first playoff win, that's just 2,500 experience points. Gotta love that. We get another crazy amount of legacy, which again, a little worried about how much legacy we're getting here and there, but it is what it is. The monument momentum boost. <laughs> History making tour continues with you leading the way. The Bears are still alive in the playoffs. You already knew that though. Give me the ball, watch what happens. So after the game again, we got another ability that we can go ahead and boost. I'm going to lose it back here. I know the Bears are talking about receiving back, but I know my strengths, and it's really to be elusive. So plus one to acceleration awareness and spin move, and plus two to ball carrier vision. That's good news. Looking at our ratings to give you a core breakdown of that. Break tackles at a 78. That's increasing slowly. Speed, acceleration are off the charts. Carrying a ball carrier vision and trucking are all looking really, really good right now. Change of direction is a 96. That's one of our strongest attributes. I think we're just a little too fast for our own good right now. We got to figure that out. And Juke moving to 89, great. A lot of stuff down here in the secondary spot, which isn't great. Catching, obviously being one of those. I know the Bears want me to improve that. I got things of my own I'm trying to figure out too. So we're making a heck of a run in the postseason. We got a big win in the divisional round against the Rams. Up next, I don't know who we're going to play. I know one thing. You keep giving me the football, no matter who we're playing. We're getting that W.